This video will focus on the element of the essential question in a lesson plan. The essential question of a lesson plan is a thought-provoking and open-ended question that serves as the guiding inquiry for the entire learning experience. It reflects the big idea or central concept of the lesson. It's a question that does not have a simple yes or no answer that requires critical thinking, analysis, and reflection. The essential question encourages students to explore the content, connect ideas, and develop a deeper understanding of the topic. It may prompt students to consider multiple perspectives, analyze cause and effect relationships, evaluate evidence, or propose solutions to complex problems. Let's try to think about some examples related to specific disciplines. For instance, if we're talking about mathematics, an essential question could be, what strategies can be used to solve real world problem involving data analysis and interpretation? For science, an essential question could be, how does energy flow through ecosystems and what impact does it have on the balance of nature? For social studies, an essential question could be, how do cultural, economic, and geographic factors shape patterns of human migration? Essential questions should encourage inquiry, foster critical thinking, and promote engagement with the content. They serve as a guide throughout the lesson, encouraging students to explore, analyze, and discuss the topic at hand. The goal is for students to develop a deeper understanding and construct meaning through their exploration of the essential question. It's highly advisable to write the section related to the big idea at the same time to write the essential question since they are related To write the essential questions, you need to think of the big idea. So first, determine the big idea, which is the overarching understanding you want students to gain from the lesson. Second, think about the cognitive depth you want to encourage in students. Craft essential questions that promote higher order thinking skills, such as analysis, evaluation, synthesis, or problem solving. Avoid questions that have simple factual answers. Thirdly, Write open-ended questions that stimulate inquiry and critical thinking. Essential questions should not have a single correct answer, but invite multiple perspectives and interpretations. Essential questions should generate discussion and encourage students to explore different aspects of the topic. Fourthly, depth and complexity. Ensure that the essential questions align with the stated learning objectives and relate them to the knowledge or skills students are expected to develop. 
throughout the lesson. Use clear and concise language when formulating the essential question to allow students to understand it easily and to be engaged with the question's content. Make the essential questions relevant and engaging to students' lives and experiences by connecting to real-world applications or personal experiences to enhance students' interests and motivation. Lastly, provoking thoughts. Once you have crafted the essential questions, include them in the lesson plan and place them in the lesson delivery in a way that will allow students and encourage them to discuss, to explore, to provide opportunities to reflect on and respond to the content that they need to explore. How can we decide if the essential questions are of high or poor quality? It's very simple for us as teachers to have our own checklist to evaluate whether the questions designed are of high quality or not by checking if they are open-ended, relevant, they stimulate students' critical thinking, they promote depth and complexity, they connect to the big idea, and they are coherent in their structure.